Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about the FOIL method for algebraic expressions. Now, the FOIL method is a method that you'll be using a lot through mathematics, especially in your algebra courses. So let's get right to it, and now uh, we'll do a couple of examples. Now, the FOIL method uses, of course, the letters F, O, I, and L. Now, the F stands for you want to multiply the first terms in each parentheses. We'll get to that in a minute. The O stands for multiplying the outside terms. The I stands for the inside, and the L stands for the last terms in each parentheses. So let's talk about that real quick. Suppose you have x minus 3, and you're multiplying that by 2x plus 1. Let's talk about the F first. F says you have to multiply the first terms in each parentheses. So that means the first term is x, the second term is the first term in this, in this second parentheses is 2x. So multiply those first terms, you have 2x squared. The O stands for the outside terms. Now the outside terms are literally outside the x and the plus 1. So you're going to multiply those two terms together. x times 1 is positive x. And then the I stands for the inside, which means you're going to multiply the interior terms of either parentheses, which means you're going to multiply the 3 with the positive 2x. Negative 3 times 2x is negative 6x. And then last, literally, the last terms, in each parentheses, so that means minus 3 and the positive 1. You're going to multiply those two, and you have negative 3. You're going to combine the like terms from there. The like terms are plus x minus 6x, which is negative 5x, and you're going to leave the other two terms the way they are. Another quick example for you. Suppose you have 3x minus 2 times 2x minus 5. The first terms, you're multiplying the first terms in each parentheses. 3x times 2x is 6x squared. The outside terms, the literal outside terms of both parentheses, 3x times negative 5, you're going to multiply those two, be negative 15. And then the inside terms of both parentheses, negative 2 times 2x, be negative 4x. And then Last but not least, you're going to multiply the last terms in each parentheses, negative 2 times negative 5, which is positive 10. Combine your like terms, negative 15x minus 4x is negative 19x, and leave the other two terms as they are. It's a very valuable method. I highly recommend that you review this, these examples, and then some, and um, practice makes perfect. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's the FOIL method for algebraic expressions.